But if you wanna say hey, say the shot One, two, three, four, line them up Well, that's alright On a Friday night You don't wanna go home No, no, no It's not too late to rock and roll No, it's alright You can get a little drunk on a Friday night Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm really excited because I'm going to share with you some of my favourite Halloween baking recipes. Halloween is literally my favourite time of the year. See all these other people who say Halloween is their favourite and they're just being cliche. No, this is literally what I live for. I'm really excited to share these recipes with you and I really hope these recipes give you some ideas for your Halloween parties, sleepovers, whatever you want to do. So let's get started. For the gingerbread skeletons you're going to need plain flour, soft dark brown sugar, butter, ginger, cinnamon, nutmeg and baking soda, black treacle and one egg. In a large mixing bowl add your brown sugar and butter and cream these together. Then incorporate in your egg and I like to scrape down the sides of the bowl with a spatula as I go along. Then add in your treacle and mix this in and then all the spices and then gradually add in the flour and I like to do this by hand just because it makes less of a mess. When all your flour is incorporated then put this into some cling film and leave it in the fridge for at least an hour to stiffen up a bit. After your dough has been in the fridge for at least an hour, flour your work surface so that the dough doesn't stick and then roll it out and cut out your gingerbread men shapes and I've got large and small gingerbread men. Then place these on a baking sheet lined with baking paper and bake at the oven for about 10-15 minutes at 170 degrees. Finally when your gingerbread men are fully cooled you can then use royal icing to decorate them and I will put a recipe for royal icing in the description. It's really easy, it's just an egg white and icing sugar. And to make the skeletons I just did little skulls and then I did their ribs and then just little bones for their arms and legs and they're done. For the Frankenstein's Monster Rice Krispie buns you're going to need some Rice Krispies, marshmallows, butter and green food colouring. Add all your marshmallows into a saucepan with the butter and some of the green food colouring and let this melt all together. Then you're just going to add this into your Rice Krispies and mix it all through and then I added it into a lined baking tray and left this to cool. Once cooled I then cut it into squares and decorated them like Frankenstein's Monster so I just used again grey royal icing and some white royal icing and then for his bolts and his neck I just used licorice that I cut in half. And finally for the ghost cupcakes you're going to need castor sugar, butter, self raising flour, three eggs, some milk and some vanilla extract. Again I'm going to start off by creaming together my butter and sugar in a large mixing bowl and then incorporating my eggs one at a time mixing after each egg. Then I'm just going to scrape down the sides of my bowl and add in my vanilla extract and then slowly add in my flour and finally just to loosen the mixture up a bit I'm going to add some milk but you could add water if you wanted. I'm then going to use an ice cream scoop to scoop this mixture into some cake cases and I've chosen white because I'm doing ghosts and this should be enough mixture to do 12 of these. And then bake them in the oven for about 20 minutes at 180 degrees celsius. Once they were cooled I then chopped off the tops and added a marshmallow and then you're going to take some white fondant. I actually made my own but you can just use shop bone fondant and then roll pieces of this out into sort of little flat discs and then set these on top of the marshmallow so it looks like a ghost costume. And then I just used royal icing to add some little surprised ghost faces. Watching. I really hope you got some ideas for Halloween baking and I'm super excited because Halloween is so 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 soon. Leave me a comment telling me what you plan on being for Halloween. I'm not decided yet. I don't know. Please give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more videos and I will see you in my next one. Bye! Get a little drunk on a Friday night